yo 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 dog what up unfortunately unlike that guy um i'm not a gangster but anyway it's uh Jozza here and i'm doing some call of duty black ops gameplay for the first time um it's a song by the script in case you don't know and this is like my second ever game i would say of call of duty black ops and people have been saying real shit things about it, but actually, I quite like playing it, because I didn't do very shit. Unlike on Modern Warfare 2, where I was... Shit. You know, is the only word to describe it. Like, diarrhea shit. But, um... Yeah, I'm okay at this, and I end up picking off some, uh, nice kill streaks, not to give any... Not to give too much away. But yeah, um, and also, um, even though I do play lots of Halo, I do play other games as well, including Call of Duty, I uh, play it with my mates, <clears throat> and I've been playing Halo Reach a lot. I put up like that little trailer thing for my clan, which eventually didn't work out, so I've set up a new clan now, but yeah, so, but Halo Reach is a really good game, and I'll be putting up some commentaries, uh, I'll be putting up some commentaries in the near future, hopefully within the next week I'll put up Halo Reach commentary. Um, and this is just me walking out the M16, which I have to say I love. So nice. Free round burst. It's a brilliant gun. A uh, bit noobish, but oh well, you can't live life and not be a bit of a noob, especially if you play Call of Duty. But um, yeah, like I said earlier, I do like the game and Dolphin Dive! There you go, first dolphin dive of the game. Um, but I actually really like... I, quite, I, I like some of the features. I, I think kind of, like most people, I don't think the idea of getting rid of quick scoping is that brilliant. Because... Um, I think a lot of the community, like, what they like to see on YouTube is quick scoping clips and crazy montage where you shoot a guy in his cock from like a thousand feet away and it rebounds through his ear or something but and kills him eventually but um it doesn't look like there's going to be a lot of those clips coming up anytime soon since they got rid of quick scoping which is a shame but you know I've, I think the game has got potential uh not as much as Halo Reach but anyway this is when I first used my chopper so I think I'm on like a 7 or 8 kill streak now I'm I'm not totally sure because I wasn't really paying attention to the video. Hopefully, you will. But, um, yeah, I mean, I'm happy if you want, you know, you can, uh, if you leave a comment, I, if you want, like, particular, I'll probably do a Halo Reach commentary next. But if there's, like, a particular map you want or, like, a particular game mode, like, I've got SWAT clips, I've got sniper clips, Slayer clips, I've got loads of clips. Um, then just give me a ring a ding ling and I can do that for you. Um, get owned here, unfortunately. But, um, yeah, I'm enjoying the game and I'm loving Halo Reach. Um, I really, really like Halo Reach. I think, you know, they, they've put it in a really good direction and it's, you know, a good game to go out on for the Halo franchise and I can't wait to see what Bungie throws next. And here, a bit of a bummer, I have a spy plane from a um, care package, so I'm just kind of like, ah, oh! throw my controller on the floor and hit some six-year-old and start mouthing off about how unfair the game is. But, oh well. That's not actually me. I'm quite chilled most of the time. Yesterday I got really stressed playing Halo because I was trying to get all the daily challenges in one day because I hadn't done it yet. And I was all like shouting at my friend and swearing and stuff, but that was just a bad day. This morning seems to be a good day, seeing as after this game I, I ranked up four levels. I went from like level four. Yeah, I went from level four to level eight. So I was just like, win! Because um, that was really cool. And also, I, I just got this game for Christmas, because, you know, it's that certain time of the year where you can just exploit thousands of people around the world by getting ridiculous amounts of presents in capitalist countries but anyway it's cool because I get Call of Duty so it's pretty sweet isn't it and here I think you'll see my friend Matt 
being a total douchebag, he's going to be like, hey look, you can do this in the game. And then he's all like, yeah, yeah I'm going to jump off of, out a fucking window and kill myself, because I'm cool like that. So, yep, um, I'm just running around now, trying to find some people. Um, I do get one more kill straight this game, and oh no, it's not this, because I just got owned, because he was hiding behind a bin. Um, bit of a hobo, if you ask me, but, oh well, you, you know, I understand, like, people get all stressy at camping and stuff, but I guess, you know, the game wouldn't be the same without constant amounts of noobs to pwn. I'm normally one of those noobs. I'd just like to let you know that. And knife! See, I get go all the way up to level 7 there because I get some challenge. And now I'm just like, fail at shooting and I get an assist. One game, the first game I played, I got like, um, it wasn't a full game, it was like half game, but I got like 9 assists. I was like kicking myself real bad. Um, but yeah, I, I don't really know what the Call of Duty franchise is going to do next because they've basically pulled out every war. And you know, I thought the Cold War one, to be quite honest, the Cold War is called the Cold War because basically no shit happened. It was basically like, it was a computer war, so it's kind of like the olden day equivalent of people arguing with each other on forums, but just between two superpowers. That was a nut shot there. So, um, but I've, I think they managed to do it and get some story. I did a few missions of the campaign. It's pretty sweet. Uh, my friend says the campaign's better than the multiplayer, but I'm, I'm not totally sure. Um, and I don't know. If, if you know this, can you leave it in the comments? Can you change your kill streaks? Because I'm just like herp a derp. I'm like level 9, and I was trying to find out how to change kill streaks, and it's just like, no, this game's too complicated for you to find out how to change kill streaks. And I recorded this on my capture device too, because I couldn't be bothered to work out how to um, do the theater my thingy. But, well, it's film in theater mode, but to upload to the computer. I got the screenshot at the beginning though up. And here I did a dolphin dive and a little bit of a wall bang. By this time, my friend Mark's real pissed off at me, because I'm like, oh, way. He's played about 10 games and is level 9. And I think I'm level 9 or level 8, and I've only played 3 games. So yeah, he's pissed and I keep saying he's shit, so he gets a bit angry, but you know, he's he's, he's okay, he's okay. Um, he's one of the members of my new clan, which um, is based in Reach and maybe Black Ops if we all get it, but mainly Halo Reach, because that's what we play, generally. Um, and I'm hoping to make a machinima on Halo Reach and Halo 3. A fusion thing. I have an idea what it is, but I can't think of a name. I was gonna write this, begin to write the script for it today, but I was just like, "Wow, what a douchebag!" You thought up of all these ideas, which you think are amazing, but they're probably shit, and you can't even think of a name. You fucking douchebag. So yeah, that's the situation. I mean, with that at the moment, but hopefully I'll get it out sometime in the new year. Until then, <clears throat> I'm aiming at doing some regular commentaries on Black Ops and. Um, Reach and maybe some other games. You know, I've got a few games. If if you want to see some unusual sorts of gameplay, I'll tell you if I have the game. Cobra Just leave it in the comments and um, I'll do that. And this is, I think, is this my? That's after my second kill streak. I think it was like 12 or something. I wasn't really paying attention um, again, but um, oh well. And. So yeah, overall, if I was, if you're a very good COD fan, like, like, modern, if you're a good Modern Warfare 2 fan, like you love Modern Warfare 2, then I don't think this game's for you, but if you're kind of like, kind of generally open to new interpretations of the game, then I would get it. And that is victory, folks, so remember, rate, comment, subscribe, do all that stuff, and I will uh, see you soon, so uh, see ya.